This is a scary feeling. Sights and sounds from tense moments of uncertainty, Structure collapse. of panic after a brick wall came crashing down into a construction zone on one of Winston-Salem's signature streets around 1.30 Tuesday afternoon. You heard it, it was a loud rumble, and then you saw a little smoke. People eating lunch, walking and working, watched as the impact shaking the ground sent a cloud of dust erupting upward. People running away from the brick dust, and then we saw people running back. Some started recording what was going on as officers ran to respond. We had asked each other, oh my God, do you think somebody's under there? And then we got here and found out that somebody was. In this video, you see officers Jordan Long and Mark Mooney. We could just see the helmet of his head. He was buried so much. The pair just down the street as it unfolded. When you actually see people pointing and confirming that there's someone in there, your adrenaline goes way up. We're the first two officers to jump in. It was really chaotic at first because everybody wants to move so fast, they want to save the person. Frantically digging and lifting, clearing a way to get the man free. It took three or four of us to lift those concrete, those concrete slabs up off of him. As other officers rushed to close down the street and block off the crowds. He wanted to move, he wanted to jump out of the hole and we had to make him just stay. Watch here, both from the air. He wanted out so bad. And the ground as the man is loaded on a stretcher and rolled away talking and moving, just as he was when Officer Long went to see him in the hospital a short time after the two of them met for the first time. And he told me that he just he just started praying and that he was happy that everybody came to dig him out and he was happy he wore his hard hat. 